Welcome back, everybody, to part two of our Breckenridge to Mariposa Yosemite Bush Tour. Last time we uh, ended up at uh, the in Yokern Airport, and if you didn't watch that video, um, up top corner here, you'll see a link to that first video, so I highly recommend you check that one out first. But we're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to go, uh, this second leg here is about 37 miles and 24 minutes approximately, and that would be the... Olencha Strip Strip Airport. So that would be this part, this guy right here. So it looks like it's just this little grass strip. So, all right, let's hop in the aircraft and uh, let's get going. All right, folks, we're here in the aircraft. Let's uh, take a look at a couple of things real quick. Let's check out our nav log and see what ha what it has us doing today so we're going to depart from the airport and begin our second leg of our trip heading northwest towards us route 395 and then eventually we're going to end up towards a lake called the lake and our second part here um, as we continue uh route 395 we'll, we're going to soar over some volcanic fields Towards this uh, highway reservoir. Oh, that's cool. And then there's the airstrip. So, not very long at all. Let's check out our VFR map. Oh, wrong button. All right. So, here we are right here. So we're going to take off um, north, north, well, northwest. And it looks like this is this little gray line here. It looks like a road. So, we'll follow this road. Must be Route uh, 395. And then this is probably little, this might be Little Lake, I guess. Because this one would be, unless this is Little Lake, I'm not sure. I think this is probably it. And here's our airport, so. Doesn't look like we're going to have any issues with uh, running into mountains today, so. All right. Let's get this, get this plane going here. All right, we're going to pull our choke. And put our strobes on. Our engine. Make sure we have controls. All right, let's do a uh, one knot of one notch of flaps. And let's check out where we're at. So this is um pretty close to where we parked last time. So we came in from we came in from this way landed on this runway i believe so we're going to do the same thing we're just going to taxi i believe it's runway 33 so we're going to taxi this way get on runway 33 then uh head out to the north These people are over here kind of bored. Nothing going on. All right, so we are ready to take off and turn on our, our landing lights. And let's go ahead and line up. Okay, here we go. And rotate. Pull those flaps up.
All right, so we are going to we need to look for route 395, which I think is right there. So we're going to continue climbing. All right, so that's it actually in front of us. I was wrong, this is it. So there's uh, Route 395 right there. All right, let's start uh, nose down here to level out. Let's do some trim. Try to get this thing level flight. Still, still working at it, trying to get this thing to trim good. Okay, so so following the road, it's starting to kind of bend a little bit here to the left. So let's see if we can see that on our VFR map. I think it's this part right here. So I'm gonna say we're probably about right here. See, there might be some little lakes or something little pools or something i don't know but that looks like where we're at so so far so good Uh-oh, did it again. Still following uh, route, US Route 395. Not a whole lot of um, scenery here. Lake Isabella in our last part of this trip was uh, really beautiful. Okay, so looking up here, we have, well, looks like those, I wonder if that's the lakes. probably this guy here so we're gonna start to see a few a few different patches of lakes here small ones and then we'll get up this kind of this bigger one then we can follow the river okay so we're probably right now right about here
All right, folks. Still following the highway here. Just taking a quick look at the scenery. It's definitely nice. It's not a whole lot, whole lot to see here. So don't see any houses or any gas stations. So I guess you gotta make sure you are you have plenty of gas where you hit this, get on this road. So let's check out outside. Definitely the color of these um, these bodies of water. I don't know if that's dried up or what. Okay, so up here we have a looks to be a bigger body of water. So let's check out our VFR map. This is probably it right here starting. We're probably right around this section here, so cool. Getting close. Okay, so we're gonna follow this lake, these three different lakes. So lake, river, lake. Well, three different bodies of water, probably the same. But so the airport is not too far off from here. First one, second one, third one, we're gonna cross over. I mean it's yeah, it should be really close. I think that's it right there, actually. All right, so here we go. Here is the river crossing over 395. So let's, let's do, okay, here it is. I see it right there. That's it. Let's go ahead and slow down. Big time. You know, I honestly don't know if this is the runway or if it's that little one over there. Because there's trees here. I'm starting to think that's the runway. You know what? Last minute decision. I'm going to land over here. I have no clue. Don't want to land in trees, so. This is probably the taxiway. But there's no trees here, so we'll do land here. All right, we are down. Just hit some brakes, and we'll see if it gives us credit once we stop. Flaps up. All right, we're down. That's it. Hit it. Awesome. All right. Well, thank you everybody for uh, continuing on the journey with me. This one was, you know, not a whole lot of scenery and I kind of talked over myself a couple times, but hey, I'm getting used to it. So, but anyways, thanks so much again for following along. If you uh, want to continue to see more stuff like this, please hit that like button and subscribe and then check that bell notifications to find out when I uh, add some more videos. Until next time, see ya.